Honorable Minister for Fisheries and Animal Husbandry and Dairy, Shri Giriraj Singh, will be visiting our uh, NFDB campus today. And, uh, and we also there are about uh, 50 farmers, active farmers who are involved in aquaculture. They are also present here, apart from other officials. Actually, uh, after becoming the minister, he is uh, coming to NFDB for the first time. So that is why we are also prepared to give him a warm welcome to him from NFDB. This is actually what we call it as a, a RAS system or the recirculatory aquaculture system. The main purpose of uh, this recirculatory aquaculture system is to demonstrate fish culture with less quantity of water. In the recirculatory system, we need not change water. So the same water you can see here, you can see here the tank is there. So initially the water is filled and it is conditioned. Then from there it is pumped into the main overhead tank. From overhead tank it will be coming to the filter, that green color three numbers you are seeing, that is the biofilter. From there the water is getting filtered and again you can see here it is coming back, here, here, here it is coming back. So this is the system and it is a continuous process. Continuously the water will be pumped and uh, it will, through the biofilter it will be coming. Main duty of the biofilter is actually to make the um, water free from ammonia. So ammonia is converted into nitrate and then nitrate which is less harmful for the fish. So the purified water, biofiltered water is coming again back to the tank. So that is why we can increase the production. So you can see this small uh, tank, this is 6.7 meter by 6.7 meter and the depth is 2 meter. So with this small area we can produce about 3 tons of fish per year. So normal, I see in uh, 1 uh, hectare only we are producing 2 to 3 tons average production. Some people are do doing up to 10 tons. Whereas here in this small area itself we can produce 3 tons per year. And also the where the market is there, you know, with less even in the urban area or rural area or backyard, you can uh, use the system. So you can produce the three tons and you will get the fresh fish and also you can sell the fish also in live condition. So live, you know, live, uh, if the ordinarily the fish is uh, fetching suppose 120 rupees uh, per kg in the market, the live fish you can get about uh, 180 rupees. So that much difference is there. That is why and also the fish is very fresh. So we can uh, culture like pangasias or uh, tilapia we can culture. Here we are doing the gift tilapia. That is the genetically improved formed tilapia. That culture we are doing here. Yeah, we have already harvested about 100 kg. So we are uh, you know, selling every week. Uh, we are selling the fish also at the rate of 150 rupees. So every Friday we are in fact harvesting and selling. Those who are uh, willing to take uh, fresh fish, they can come and buy from here itself. See the cost of uh, setting up of this facility is around 5.6 lakhs rupees and the recurring cost will be around 1.4 lakhs so totally I say about 7 lakhs is the project cost depending upon the species and the duration the cost recurring cost will vary little bit yes this is the first time actually we have introduced this technology now in our campus and many farmers you know every day farmers are coming and visiting they are getting motivated so already about 75 units have been set up in Kerala about uh, 65 applications are there in Telangana also. There are people from other states like West Bengal and Assam, they have also applied. So in a phased manner, the demonstration or the, the culture will be taken up by others also. This open, uh, all these demonstration units are open for uh, farmers so that they can learn the technology, they can see, witness the technology by their own eyes and uh, also they can adopt the technology. That is our objective. Now it is uh, seven months old. Seven months back we have started. And uh, we have got three cages, like uh, this cage we have stocked seven months back. Again, after 45 days, we have stocked the third cage. This one now we have kept empty, it is all, we can all stock in this cage also. So it will be a continuous production. So any moment, any part of the year, you can say that uh, the harvestable size is available. That is also an advantage in this system.